Good morning, I'm Brooke Hafes with NBC26, and this is your morning news update. Gun deer season is just three days away, and there are some changes you should know about. After a deer tested positive for chronic wasting disease in Upper Michigan, the DNR is adding their fourth self-service kiosk. It's just across the river for hunters to drop off their deer heads for CWD sampling from the Pembine area. The DNR says they have not found any CWD in any wild, free-ranging deer, but they are continuing to monitor a few locations. Now, the easiest way to get a deer hunting license is to do it online through gowild.wi.gov. There you can set up an account and purchase your licenses. You can also download the Hunt Wild Wisconsin mobile app. This gives you all the public lands to explore, brush up on regulations, and more. For more tools and information on gun deer hunting in Wisconsin, just head to our website, NBC26.com. Wisconsin's nine-day gun deer season starts this Saturday and runs through November 25th. I'm meteorologist Michael Fish with NBC 26. As far as today, less wind than yesterday and a couple degrees warmer. It's still going to be on the cold side, but on the quiet side as well. We're going to have a quiet night tonight as well without much wind and tomorrow more sunshine for you. So as far as today, 30 degrees, a couple clouds passing on by, but nothing falling out of them for the most part. Still cool, but less wind than yesterday, about five degrees warmer than yesterday as well. For tonight, 18 degrees, mostly clear skies, and as far as tomorrow, going up to 38, so a little bit of an improvement with the temperatures. Wind slowly starting to pick up. Now, as far as late Thursday night, could see a couple snow showers sneak on through, then a break for Friday, another chance of snow showers Friday night, and most of the weekend going to be breezy and cool with temperatures around freezing. Now, stay connected all day every day at NBC26.com or download the NBC26 app for free on the App Store.